Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Eileen. Today we're going to look at John Renault Marion in 12FS12, which of course is Malibu Blonde. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe to my channel and be sure to follow me over on Instagram. Now a little later on, I'm going to compare Marion to John Renault Cameron, so be sure to stay for that. I'll have photos and a video of both of these wigs and outdoor lighting, so all of that will be at the end of the video, so please be sure to stay for that. I purchased this wig with my own funds from Wig Studio. Studio One. Can't wait to show it to you, so let's get started. Okay, the style of John Renault Marion. This is a very sleek shoulder length bob. Lots of movement. Really, really beautiful. I love these, of course, soft, beautiful John Renault fibers. I like the sleekness of this. It's a professional look. Now, this one is right out of the box. As you can see, it tends to want to fall forward. I'm not a big fan of that. <laughs> so I will absolutely be uh, steaming this off my face. But I just want to just show you that and call it to your attention. Of when you get it, it might be falling forward. Uh, it has a beautiful lace front. Mono top. Coverage is good. Really cannot even see my bio hair on this one. It has really nice coverage. So if that's a concern for you. I have a, a 21 and a quarter inch head circumference. This fits me fine. Also, my face is nine inches from hairline to chin. So if that gives you any idea how this might fit on you. It, this one has a bang of 11 inches. The crown also is 11. The sides are nine and a half and it has a seven and a half inch nape. I like the style of this. I like that the uh, length offers you a lot of styling options. I would probably twist it back, put a pin in it, easy to do, headband, glasses. I just don't think there's anything you can't do with this one. Yeah, works perfect with glasses. This would be good pulled back on both sides to show that lace front. You pull it back in the back. You could braid it. There's just a lot, I think, that you could do with this one. Now, let's talk about the color. 12 FS12 Malibu Blonde. You know, this is the lighter rooted version of Shaded Praline, which, of course, is 12 FS8. I personally appreciate this lighter rooting. Uh... I used to wear shaded praline and still do, but I prefer this one. I prefer the rooting on the Malibu Blonde. And you know, it has this uh, golden blonde running all through. It also has pale gold blonde, and you can see the pale gold blonde, I believe. And like I said, I'll have this in outdoor lighting. I think you'll be able to really pick up those different shades of blonde running through here. Okay, let's have a look at the inside of the cap. Okay, here's a look at the inside of the cap, that large mono top we talked about with a contoured lace front, closed ear tabs with stays, Velcro adjusters, extended felt nape, open wefting, and it has a little stretch here. It's nice that you have the parting options here on this mono top. And here is a look at 12 FS12 Malibu Blonde. Okay, that was a look at the inside of Marion. Now, I have on my John Renault Cameron, and this is also the same color, Malibu Blonde. Both sleek styles. Here is my Marion. I just wanted you to, of course, they're the same color, side by side. Now, how they're different. Cameron that I have on is hand tied. And like you saw on Marion, Marion has the mono top, but Cameron is hand tied. And I will have inside of the cap side by side photos as well. So the price point on Cameron is a little more due to the cap construction of the hand tied cap. Uh, the bang on Cameron is 10 inches. Again, my face is nine inches from hairline to chin. And the bang on the Marion is 11. The crown on the Cameron is 12. Where the crown on the Marion is 11. The sides on the Marion are 9.5. And, and the sides on the Cameron are 7.75. So it's a little shorter there. The nape 
on this Cameron is four and a half and the Nape on the Marion is seven and a half. So as you can see, the Marion is a bit longer than the Cameron, but they're similar styles. So I want you to kind of get a look at that. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. Again, stay to the end for some more outdoor video and photos of both of these beautiful wigs. Please like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram for Wig to Toe Wednesday, Coffee with the Crazy Wig Lady. Uh, my makeup and wig giveaways all happen over there, so I look forward to seeing you, seeing you over on Instagram. Thanks so much, and I'll see you next time.